Backroads is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund with money by the vote of the people November 4th, 2008. I'll be playing Owen Mann, our bass player Calvin Lund, and our sax player Joe Anderson, and uh, our guitar player Jacob Mann. And we're a new Salty Dog. Well, new Salty Dog is what happened when we decided we didn't want to be the old Salty Dog anymore. 
Our previous name was Jacob Man and the Salty Dogs, and we wanted to make the band a little more unified. So we decided to go with New Salty Dog to kind of incorporate everyone else's. It's fresh. Yeah. It's new. You know, it's not one man. It's the, it takes the whole army, right? I love the party. I love that chapter, but there ain't nothing like what happens after. Oh, get up to your room, slam the door, boom, and we'll bury each other.
personally have a deep want to be able to play as much music as possible and being in a couple of extra projects other than our own kind of allows myself and I'm sure Jacob as well to free. We can do three nights in a row in the same bar but just with different bands and there's you know it's kind of a little more acceptable for people to come out, it's a different music. It's also just fun to get different flavors of, of music and being able to, you know, kind of dip in and, and play and come back to the things that we write. I, I think it broadens our, our perspective as musicians. Yeah, we made a CD called Pecan Pecan last Thanksgiving time. We released it, recorded it with Nate Olson on the piano and, and Adam Johnson on the trumpet. We've had a lot of sweet people that have been willing to play with us and we didn't really have a release for it or anything because COVID, but we've been trying to get rid of them, you know, as much as we can. So if we see you at a show, make sure you, Yep. we'd love to give one to you.
A lot more people come out now that we're playing a lot more often, I think. And, and I, I do think since COVID's happened, I think a lot of people g did grow hungry for music and kind of the arts in general. And I think because it was over the summer, outdoor shows became, became a thing again. We've been seeing a lot of places have a little higher attendance and things like that, which has been really great. It's been really fun. See some good people.
done and done and done and done with the bell this night could be living hell or just as well Thanks, everybody. <laughs> that was uh, fun. Thanks. Backroads is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund with money by the vote of the people November 4th, 2008.